If you make these mistakes it could be really bad for your overall progress in the game. So watch the video to find out how to not do these and progress faster in the game. Guys now before every video I will do a shout out to random 3 people who comment on my video. So make sure to leave a comment down below to have a high chance of appearing in my next video. Ok so the first crucial mistake that I see a lot of beginners make is that they are putting random stat points. That is bad because you have limited points and you should put them in melee and defense and depending on what you are using blocks fruit or sword. Honestly I suggest you to put them in blocks fruit if you don't have a logia fruit. Now there is also the gun but guns in this game are not made for grinding. They can stun the enemy and are mainly used for PvP. Also you can use them to lure a bunch of enemies in one place and kill them easily, but you don't need to put stat points in them for that. So that translates into the second big mistake. Using guns for grinding. Honestly I made this mistake and I regret it. Especially early game guns are trash. So yeah, please don't use guns otherwise you will waste your progress. So the next mistake I see a lot of beginners make is they don't know or forget to buy the hockey, sky jump and flash step. So here at Frozen Village you can buy all of them from the ability teacher pretty cheap. They aren't going to drastically change your grinding at the time but it will be super super useful later on in the game. Sky jump and flash step are important but it is more important to buy the enhancement ability, hockey. That is because while grinding you will be able to get a ton of hockey XP and evolve it into the higher stages which will be super useful later in the game. Just make sure to not use fruit to grind because you can't get hockey XP with fruit attacks. I made a video on how to get full body hockey so check it out if you want. Also if you are still watching make sure to leave a like and a subscribe, thanks. So the next mistake is not buying observation hockey. It allows you to dodge opponents attacks and to see them through walls and etc. It is pretty useful and you can get it here at these upper sky islands from Lord of Destruction. Use a cannon and shoot at these clouds and hop in. I don't have a cannon right now so I won't go there, but, when you hop in there you will find the Lord of Destruction who will sell you this observation hockey for 750k Peli. Also you need to be level 300 plus and completed the Shanks Saber puzzle. This ability can be evolved into stage 2 which allows you to see opponents fighting style, sword, fruit and etc. Also by using it you earn XP which makes this ability even more powerful so that's why it is important to get it early. Here it is in action. And the next big mistake a lot of beginners make is they choose a bad fruit. Personally I made this mistake, when I started playing I used rubber because of the anime. Now don't get me wrong, rubber can be pretty good but it's really not the best fruit that you can get if you want to grind levels fast. I suggest you that when you are starting playing the game save up your money until you can afford light, magma, ice, dark, or something like that. Of course the best option would be human buddha but it is too much for beginners. Choosing these fruits will make your grinding so much easier and faster. But if you want to have fun and not to grind then choose whatever you want. Oh look what I found. I literally found rumble by accident. Anyways, I got a bonus mistake for you. So when I started playing I was roaming around the first sea hoping to find something like dragon, soul, gravity. Now that would be fine if I had a fruit detector, but guess what? I did not. So that could be a mistake that you were making. If you don't have a fruit detector don't bother going around the map hoping for some god tier fruit. You are going to get it faster by saving up money and checking the Blox fruit dealer stock every 4 hours. Or you can also buy a random fruit from Blox fruit dealer cousin every 2 hours. He is pretty up, I got some pretty up fruits like gravity, buddha and etc from him, so yeah. That's it for this video, I hope I helped you. Thank you so much for watching and see you soon.